Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. I am doing a VR for Happy Girl Tiff. She is on Instagram and on YouTube and she is having a pink lemonade 50th birthday and I will have her video and her Instagram information down in my description area so you guys can go click it and follow her and get all the rest of the important information. Um, I believe you have to DM her and uh, find out her address. The requirement of her 50th birthday is that you create in the pink yellow theme and the only requirement is that you do an embellishment box and one shaker. It must be mailed by 1st of August and you can definitely get extra points by doing a VR on YouTube or Instagram story and anything crafty. So for example, you can make any kinds of embellishments, flowers, or any crafter's choice. Whatever you love making and you want to share with Tiffany. So I am going to now share with you guys what I have made. I am so glad that these things are really challenging me and getting me back into the crafty mode. So I am really thankful. So first off, I will start off with the embellishment box. So I have this beautiful pink mesh. Now this one I got from BB Craft a long time ago and I really have enjoyed sharing this material with many crafters. And I am also going to send it to Tiffany as well but in the form of a wrapper. So I'm going to wrap it all around my embellishment box. So let's show you what my embellishment box looks like. So I have refurbished an embellishment box that was gifted to me. Now, when this was gifted to me, it had a belly band and I really, really love the belly band, which I keep separately. And I got to fill this entire container with all of the yellow, lemony, sunshiny colors, as well as the pink. I also have layered so many different things to create the cover. So it starts off with the yellow doily, but the yellow doily is actually inside the um, front cover. And Everything started off with this mason jar, which is actually a shaker. I have used a yellow chipboard here as well. And also this uh, girl, I added a little tiny pink bow on it. And also I have this glitter, like a scalloped edge circle. And it's got glitter, rific butterfly, as well as this flower I made. And it's also on a tag with some citrus images on it. And I really love how this has turned out. And I've also got this puffy heart that's all being stitched. And I am also sharing some of this with Tiffany as well. So she can use it for her embellishment layering. The back is just like this. I have used two different paper to cover the back side of it. So when you open it, I'll show you. So when you open it, you can actually see different um, patterns underneath all of the embellishments that I have included. So I went through all of my charms and bead sections and I try to gather as many different kinds of pink lemonade theme goodies that she can use for her future crafting. And I really think just looking at this alone, it's very, very happy. So I put here gathered with much care, soleil and craft 2023. And I really, really love how this has turned out. So that's my embellishment box, which I'm going to put here. And then I'm going to just cover it like this. And then I'm also going to um, wrap this yarn around. This is two different types of yarn. One is the like a pink sherbet type of like gelato type of color yarn. And I've also got the lemony sunshine color yellow uh, thread type, like more like an embroidery yarn. And I put them together so I can wrap it around this. So I'm just going to just 
wrap it around like this and then I am just going to do a tie a bow with it like this and so Tiffany can also use this colorful yarn to make her future tassel tassel dangle or tassel to add to um, beaded dangle whatever she would like to do so that's how it's gonna go and I'm probably gonna put this in a bubble mailer kind of thing to protect it and then put it in a small box then I have now I have shared this with you guys in my BB craft project share number two video how I have packaged all of these beautiful puffy sequin embellishments I love these they're so so pretty so I have put several of those as my extra gift to Tiffany and it says I want you to know how amazing you are that's a layered embellishment then I am also gifting this one here which I also shared in the BB craft it is a really lovely pocket that is also a shaker and this clip comes off if you haven't seen my BB craft video and this tag comes off and I really love the colors involved in this layered shaker tag I made the shaker part with the lemony pinky color in it and also this bird is a chipboard piece as well as the passion word and I've also got this beautiful glittery heart layered between the butterfly flag bit and also the flower and I've also got this lemony dots as part of the flower and I really love how this has turned out so it simply just goes in like that and then I am clipping this which is another gift and it's got strawberry wax paper in here which she can do so many different things with then my shaker embellishments I am I've got this ice cream shaker here I've actually added another glittery bow on top to tie everything together. This one down here is a blessed bumblebee cup. It's all in pink, which is a shaker. This one here is my um, dangle, well, dangle embellishment. That's what I'm calling it. And it's got like fabric bits and different hearts. It's got many different textures that have created that. And then on the other side, I've got those puffy hearts that I've gathered together and stitched along. So Tiffany can use those for future embellishment making. And I really love how all of these look in here. So I've got that. I've got more shaker mason jars that I wanted to share with her. This is just so pretty, all of the colors in here. And the flower piece that I have um, altered. Now this flower here, it had some different seed beads in the middle which I took off and changed to match the color that I wanted in my head. And then this is a really, um, I think it's got like maybe one, two, three, four, five different butterflies layered. So she can add like a, more word pieces or anything else to further embellish if she wants to. The other side, I have created these balloon embellishments. So I have a um, like a frame die that also has like little circular balloons that come with it. And I made sure that I had enough cut out in different pattern paper. And then I created the cluster myself. Then I also wanted to add a bow, a like different kind of bow at the bottom. So I did that and I also added a different texture to the, instead of using just a string, I wanted to use different kind of textures to create a really lovely balloon embellishment. So that's what I've done. So I love those. Then I've also got this one here, this package here. It says happy birthday. Now that's the faux glittery leather piece down at the bottom. It's a scallop circle piece. It's all in pink. Happy colors. And then I've also used this beautiful pinky pattern paper behind to hold my tassel dangle charm. And I have shared this one with you guys previously before I moved. And I will also have that video down in my description area if you haven't watched that because I absolutely enjoyed making this. 
So I started off by making the beaded tassel part, then I added another chain to add more of the dangles and it just looks so pretty. I made those in many different color themes so I can use it for future mail and future gifts. So I really love how that turned out. Then I've also got this one here, sunshiny flower piece. That's like, um, it's a wire, a wire that's being wrapped around this organza little bag. And inside it's got my uh, wooden embellishment brooches that I've also shared in the BB craft. And it's got some more of the chunkier style um, resin cabochons and things in here that Tiffany can use for future crafting or to share with her future happy mail friends. So that's everything I will be sending off to her. I really have enjoyed putting this embellishment box together. So when she receives it, hopefully in two weeks time, you guys please go over to her channel to see her opening my entry. Thank you so much for being here. And if you guys are in USA or anywhere near USA, you still have plenty of time to mail it by 1st of August. Thanks so much. Bye.